वेलकम इन अ यूनिवर्स कम्युनिटी आई एम संचिता पांडे एंड आई एम सो ग्लैड टू कनेक्ट विद ऑल ऑफ यू वंस अगेन आर टॉपिक फॉर टुडे इज फेवर इन योर लाइफ एंड दिस फेवर इन योर लाइफ कम्स व्हेन यू आर लीस्ट प्रिपेयर टू रिसीव इट एंड यू वोंट सी इट कमिंग एक्चुअली सो मेनी स्पीकर्स मोटिवेशनल स्पीकर्स हैव गिवन ब्यूटीफुल एग्जांपल्स लाइक फॉर एग्जांपल ईस्टर हिक्स हैज गिवन दिस एग्जांपल ऑफ व्हेन वी आर गोइंग टू द मार्केट we have left our house and we are going towards the market now midway we have not reached the market so do you return oh the market isn't seen anywhere so i go back home no you still continue in faith that yes when you keep going you will reach the market likewise in a restaurant you order just once that's it and then you start chatting with your family members or friends you do not think twice you do not order twice because you know it must come everything you have ordered must come on your table joel austin has given a beautiful example of how 12 pm changes to 12 am right when it is still dark the birds aren't chirping and it is silent it is still night and you cannot see a single ray of the sun does it mean it is not am no it is morning but you cannot see the morning what is is still dark still silent does it mean it is not happening no that is what happens in our life too sometimes all that you have desired comes in turmoil during the turmoil not during the calm it is when there is so much of confusion now why does this happen this is because you have to go through a process in life through a journey before you are elevated to the next level so there will be closed doors everybody will start acting funny around you your friends all acquaintances no support only opposition but can they stop you no because god is there to favor you and that closed door was never meant for you and if they had not closed the door that was god's wish you wouldn't have changed your path you would have kept knocking at that closed door all you have to do is change your path change your way make certain changes in faith to receive god's favor and if you do not pass the test of patience of strong spiritual muscles of doing the right things at any point of time then what happens is those tests will be repeated in your life and till you pass those tests you will never be able to elevate you will not be elevated to the next level so all that you call difficulty is actually the key to your success all that opposition is the key to your success to manifesting your desires and getting all that you have ever wished because you see prayers and blessings they are always answered they are always answered but in the divine timing so it will be divine ways it will be divine process it will be divine timing you cannot force it because god sees when you are actually prepared to be raised to the elevated to the next level we plan to go to the theater one day and something happened we had some other work we could not go the next day we said no we must go to the theater and we started quite right in time and still there was lot of traffic jam and even one minute late means you could not enter the theater and so we went to some other place enjoyed and came back but we did not watch the theater on the third day we reached quite right in time and then we were surprised to see legendary figures all around from various fields we had legendary singers we had theater personalities and everybody and it was what an experience it was and then i realized why we were not able to reach their previous two days so you see God has better plans for you which we are not able to understand during the process and always remember nobody nobody can stop 
your miracles from coming to you because that is the favor of god that is what you have prayed for and prayers go up and blessings come down so prayers are always answered the universe always has your back all you have to do is walk keep walking in faith keep track of your emotions that is you have to learn virtues on the way you have to learn virtues like honesty patience and all these virtues are what are going to make all the difference in your life they are going to carve you into a better individual and then you will be elevated to a better level to the next level so nobody can stop miracles from coming to you because you have god's blessings on you and whatever you see around the life that you see now that is what is do not let it take a way of faith because that is the process through which you are honed that is the process through which everyone must go to pass the test of god of the universe so one who takes care of their emotions one who always has faith come what may that is you are not thanking god when you get all the things right in your life you are also thanking god when sometimes things are not going your way during that illness you are still thanking god for all that is good in your life that is when blessings that is when favors are going to be seen in your life that is when you will see favor in your life So are you trying to understand God's ways no you will never be able to understand that because God is omnipresent supernatural and his ways his favors will come in ways which you will never be able to understand and that is why we call them miracles and miracles happen every day that illness which you think is just it cannot heal no it is possible to heal that something which you have always wanted that dream which you have always wanted to pursue everything that you have ever wanted in your life is possible financial freedom financial abundance abundance in terms of health wealth prosperity peace in your life everything is possible all you need is to stay in belief when you are still not able to see it coming in your life because because be sure that it has already happened only thing is you are not able to see it in the physical realm it is happening for you the universe is carving a story just for you just imagine somebody who can take care of the ants the trees the caterpillar every bird gets its food every day will that almighty leave you no it is not possible so stay in faith because favor is coming in your life only when you keep believing that it is coming so stay in belief trust the process learn during the process unlearn during the process and pass the test to see everything that you have ever desired in your life my love and blessings are always with you thank you so much in a universe community We'll meet again in our next video. Stay safe, stay smiling. Bye. Namaste.